You're watching Mad Boy Labs, How the Wims Terrorist Works. For a more general video on the Wims Terrorist device, check out Mad Boy Labs, Wims Terrorist Electrostatic Generators. The Wims Terrorist device is a high voltage direct current generator, referred to as an influence machine, using electrostatic induction to separate the charges. A description of the working device requires an understanding of electrostatic induction, which is broken out in its own video. First, the basic components. You have two counter-rotating insulating discs with conducting sectors, two neutralizing circuits, two pickups typically connected to a spark gap and a capacitor. Let's have a look at how charges move around on the device by charging a few sectors and spinning the wheels. The first charge reaches the location opposite the neutralizing circuit, inducing a charge separation across the neutralizer, charging the sectors on the opposite disc. The wheels turn, separating the induced charges from the neutralizing circuit, and the system has an additional two charged sectors. This repeats, and we've also added enough charge of our own to set things in motion. Here there is a charged sector across from both neutralizing circuits, inducing a separation of charge across both discs. And again the wheels turn, separating the induced charges. This typically repeats until all the sectors on the disc are charged. So at the neutralizers, we have opposite charges being induced and then pulled apart, where they go on to induce more charge or be collected. At the collectors, like charges are continuously being forced together. This causes charges to jump between the sectors and the collectors, where they build up on the parallel plates of the capacitor. Eventually, the voltage will rise to a point where it will ionize the air between the spark terminals and discharge the capacitor. The polarity depends on the initiating charge and will remain constant once it's started, although the device will work both ways. There are observable differences between the positive and negative discharge at the terminals, but that's a topic that we cover in Mad Boy Labs Electrostatic Discharge. Support Mad Boy Labs with your subscription, and I will bring you more of my mad devices.